My name is Comfort Hajra Mukasa. I am the program manager for water sanitation and hygiene programs for Amref Health Africa in Uganda. I am also the principal investigator for sanitation digital solution system, also referred to as Sanidix. As Amref, our sole purpose of existence is to create a lasting health change in Africa. And part of the lasting health change contribution comes directly from community, since we're deeply rooted in communities and partner with them to develop solutions that are sustainable. I serve women and children to ensure that they get better health through AMREF projects in Amul district. We very well know that women have got health challenges. On the onset of COVID in Uganda in March 2020, the challenges became bigger and bigger. There were restrictions on movement. Most of the businesses being locked. We saw the men coming from towns and going to the rural areas. All these brought challenges, a brought heavy burden on the women and children. And this intensified or increased the burden to the woman. It meant that the woman was the breadwinner at home. Food was very expensive during COVID-19. Babies born in March, most of them were immunized towards the end of the year. So as Amref, what did we do then? We were seen as savior because we never, our organization never closed down. We integrated our project activities into the district activities. And by names of Namatateo, I work with Amref Health Africa on a program called Finish Mondial. Finish is financial inclusion, improves the sanitation and health. The program aims at improving access to safely managed sanitation facilities uh, in targeted communities. We target people with disabilities. We target women. We want everyone to really have that safe toilet. We have youth, both male and female, marketing the sanitation facilities we are promoting. As a nurse counselor and a, uh, and a woman, I, I really love my job uh, because I know women, we are really, we have that blessing from God. We are teachers, one. Uh, always people listen to us. We always bring out the message very well compared to men, but still uh, in this uh, COVID related, I really want to encourage men also to be involved because the moment you escort your wife, you know what is happening, you know the due date when, the, when your wife is supposed to be delivering and this helps you as a family how to get good planning for safe delivery. And also as AMREF, we hire, we hire a medical team to go and support, add on those uh, hospitals which are in their catchment area we, and we give the service for five days. And in those areas, people are poor, women are poor. But above all, we always empower them. As a VST, when staffs are, are, are sought, we can also fix there to help them so that to help also our community. Not only the staffs, because the staffs are not staying with us, they are far. Like at night, when mothers are also time for labor, it was really make, make us, as a VST, we are the staffs here in the community. At times, even in the time whereby you cannot know that somebody is coming to your house to knock your door, we are there already standing as a VST to help these mothers, to link for them until also they reach the facility. It has really so me happy, happy, and I remain as a, a VST, or not only a VST, a healthy worker. Thank you, MREF. Dear women, I implore you 
as we celebrate Women's Day, to save for health, grow and store enough food, and seek prompt health care for better health. Mm -hmm.